we have we have big news for all the community and it the news is composed in two parts is that right daniel dos two dos partes so the first part is um the web3 wizards we we're just, hiring wizards we're yeah we went out there we went out to look for something magical and we found the web3 wizards yes right so they're going to be our marketing partners. Here's a brief description that they passed us. Web3 Wizards is a group of advisors, investors, founders, influencers, and DZens which are deeply rooted in the space. Members include Crypto Gorilla, founders of Lunar and Coin Games, core members of Habibis and Celefice, OpenDAO, leadership team at Neo Tokyo, and more. The Wizards have a network spanning the entire NFC space and have advised a variety of different projects. Karafuru. Bubble World, Bubble World, Antonym, Helix, and MPH, also known as My Pet Hooligan. Why are we going with Web3 Wizards? And what is the idea? What is the objective? So um, actually, everybody inside of Web3 Wizards are actually holders. Some of them hold up to five or even more. And we've all we've been in contact with the majority of them since December. Since day one. So these are all people that have been in contact with us. We were actually looking through chats and they were like, hey, we actually, one of the guys was like, actually, I was talking to you in December. And I look back and almost each and every one of them we had been in contact with from December. So these are people who understand the project. They believe in the project and they're all current holders. And this is something that's really important to us is work with people who understand us, who have our back, who believe in what we're doing. And they're not just like, oh, like, oh, we can do the hype. They're like, oh, we can do the hype and the whole thing. We want people who really believe, who have been with us on this journey, who understand where we're strong, where we need to improve. And um, we felt that they they basically covered all of the all of the um, all of the bases. So their objective is going to be solely and specifically in the kind of the grassroots of Web three. So connecting us to strong communities. They have very strong and deep ties in some of the most important communities in the space. Um, so really hooking up collabs. We're, we're going to start uh, getting collabs uh, and bringing whitelist to our community, uh, setting up AMAs, and uh, really kind of building support um, in large communities. And um, and yeah, their, their focus is 100% Web3. They have a lot of experience in tokenomics as well, marketplaces, and all these kind of things that we're going to be working on in the future. But um, yeah. but their focus is is really kind of building up excitement as we get closer to reveal and hopefully putting us in a really good position to to basically sell out field date. So the Web3 Wizards are on board. They're a group of seven and we're seven top. core members, but then they have larger teams. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. You're right. All right. Let's keep on going. So the other team that's going to be working with us in the there's, marketing, there's another team, there is another team is second team. So it's a damn double whammy. Um, we're we also locked in a partnership with a troll. There we go. Uh, uh, yes. This is not something you bump into every day. This is something big. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. So um, why are we why are we going with petrol ad? Well, like we said at the beginning um, of this section, we see our needs in two spaces. You've got Web three, obviously. And then you've also got Web2, which has a lot of opportunities for partnerships, for, in our case, for branding and for reaching out to targeted um, IPs and brands that we could collaborate with. And we believe that Petrol Ad is um, an ideal partner for this. Yeah, um, I think what, 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 we, what we identified with Petrol Ad, number one, is that they're deep in the gaming space. Basically, that's where they come from. They've uh, done the marketing for more than 3,500 projects. So they have some experience, some of the best games and, and IPs out there. And what we really liked about them is that immediately in the first five seconds of the call, they knew exactly what they were looking at. And they understand the value of, of, of sales and skins and games, um, of uh, representation, virtual representation and game worlds, um, the interactivity, and they also understand the difficulty kind of Web2 brands are having coming into Web3 and what an incredible tool this would be. They they had some really cool things to say. They said this was a super tool. Yeah, Jonathan they, actually took some notes. What else did they say? 
They had some okay. really good. They, when they described what we were doing, we were like, okay, this is the right team for us, right? Yeah, yeah. They actually coined a couple concepts yes. for us. And one of the guys was like, he's like, he's visualizing the visual. Not one of the guys. It was a CEO. Yeah, and he's like, um, for me. The visual wallet is a power tool. This, is, this was just a, a, a conversation, a power tool with beautiful cosmetic results, a foundational system and an industry catalyst. Industry catalyst. That was a good one. That was very good. A power tool. I also thought was was great. Foundational um, system. So these people they understand system. everything that can be layered on top of the, the, the technology we're building and the possibilities they bring and they express it in those kind of words. No. Yes. foundational system like something that can be a, a springboard for the the kind of, of of projects and communities that they're in contact with yeah so yeah so th those are kind of things uh their deep connection to web 2 brands coming into the web 3 space their deep understanding and their deep connection uh with gaming and understanding so their object they're gonna ha their core objectives are number one the um, the the basically the communication the wording what we are and what we're doing and then how that's going to branch off into a b2b like how are we going to communicate this to web3 brands and blue chip companies and then uh, how are we going to communicate this to the public right so uh it's going to be the core messaging and then that message being broken down into two target audiences one is these you know legacy blue chip web 2 brands that are coming into the space and then they're going to also break it up into a direct consumer communication um so yeah that's that's our core objective and then they have one more objective which is uh to really identify and lock in a great partnership with um with um with a web 2 brand that's coming to the space uh there's a lot of of, of uh great uh, corporations that own some of the best ips in the world that are have uh, raised immense amounts of capital to build their metaverse and their kind of interactive and immersive experiences and we think that we can really play a big role in that and helping some of these and um, being good partners and ideal partners for um, these ips that are going to be building their immersive worlds because of our experience because of the tools we've built so um that's kind of the the, the core objective for them is the messaging and then really identifying a great partner uh for the following um you know for the for the, and and they already suggested some really great ips that they know would be interested in what we're doing um like i think it was in the second in the first day they they hit us up with some ideas of some really incredible ips that we would love to work on that uh we're already looking for for a partner like us so we're very um very optimistic about about this partnership so that's that's petrolad we're ready to go guys